What is up, everybody? Welcome back to AK Zolotl. We have the full release now. Uh, is it full release or is it technically just early access? Because before we played a demo, we look at the store page for AK Zolotl. Uh, it's at 74% right now. It looks like full release. AK Zolotl out now. 1.0 has got to be. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Once again, we only played the demo before. See if I can't make it borderless full screen, then we don't have to deal with uh, my Elgato freaking out every single time that I want to close it. Screen shake. We'll, we'll just leave everything on for now. Um, controller. We got all the buttons there. Pet is Y. Okay. Important to know. Let's get into it. Axolotl mode, you are not afraid of a challenge and normally play other roguelite action shooters. This experience is the default mode des designed by our team. Or there's Axolotl mode. No, definitely Axolotl. On a pale blue dot, somewhere in the observable universe, lives an extraordinary creature. What is this? Known locally as the Axolotl. These aquatic salamanders live a free and peaceful life. And with their bellies full and no natural predators in sight, it's easy to rest by the warmth of the campfire. However, letting your guard down can come at a great cost. Flat Earth alert. This axolotl has slept through the entire incident. With little time to think about their lost children, their sole motivation is the desire to feed. Uh. A full axolotl is a happy axolotl. Oh, oh dear. Axolotls can excuse stolen children, but they draw they the can. line at stealing food. Someone is about to get f***ed up. You stole my food! Take my children, but not my food. My mouse pointer is still in the middle of the screen. That's really annoying. Let's get it. So, Gungeon crossed with Blazing Beaks, I would say. A uh, new gun here. Uh, how do I switch between my guns? Why? Classic. Signy sign. Hello, hungry fella. Have you heard that? You can hold the ability to use your snack ability. It will even heal you. I'm sure it tastes better than a wooden sign. Hee <laughs> hee. Luck trigger is heal. I thought I didn't have food. But now I have food? Maybe I got food from killing those enemies. What's up, dude? Hey, what if you just stay here? There's a duck at the other side, so don't use dash to jump over the water or it might get scared. LB is dash. Sus sign. Did I have to kill that? Okay, that's a that's an active bomb. All right. Wow, wow. Can I go ahead and actually change the... No, I can't change any of the buttons right now. Okay, because I'd rather put dodge on left trigger and ability on left bumper. New gun. Okay, I kind of like this guy though, the sawed off. Let's go for a star. I don't know what that is. Lord OTG with the prime sub. Thank you for that. Da David Attenborough. It's aquatic. You hear him say that. Butter knife, increase your damage by 10%. Magazine, you can't read this one, but it increases your max ammo by 10%. Black goo, become a sticky. Become sticky and leave a trail of goo. Uh, a trail of goo, thanks. Oh, I gotta pick it up again. That's, it's fine. It's not worth mentioning. It's not worth mentioning. Don't get too negative, huts. I, I like if I open up a chest and I pick something, you just give it to me instead of putting it on the ground. I don't know. Whatever. Why would you do that? I can't have you causing this much trouble. I have no other option to show you a stop sign. What did I do? Sign? I we were friends. What the? 
You were a chameleon all along. It's really convenient that after you kill the enemies, they just give you all their stuff in a nice packaged chest. That's a great chest, though. I want to take that with me. It looked velvety. Leave that shit behind and put that in my house. You know how expensive a chest like that would be at the furniture store? How long it would take me as an axolotl to develop the technology necessary to create a velvety, nice chest? Can't get in there, okay. Can I do something with this? Can't do anything with that? No, nope. I'm not sure why I'm here. It looks like maybe we get to choose different starting weapons. Looks like we're maybe starting over. Rampage begins. Enter a run for the first time. That was just a tutorial, obviously. Should have taken the time to remap the buttons, but it is what it is. I got a special leaf for that. Oh, look at all the stuff on the side. Is that like salt pile, honey, fish, ham? I don't know. I don't know what that all was. Mm, health up? Question mark. Or star. Star was an item, right? Watch out for the Rattatas. Favorite part so far? Music. Get more leaves. Gotta get some triangles. I grab these. What does the duck even do? I just feel bad. Shotgun... Got shot... Shot Increases your damage by 40%, but decreases accuracy. Veggie. Not as tasty, but increases your health by one. This is the way to obtain immunity to explosions. Helmet. Let's go. I'm assuming that means we're immune to explosions, and it doesn't just mean it's the way to to start being immune. That's probably a heal, I guess. Let's go for a new gun. The way? Do you know the way? Yeah, it was a weird, weird way to phrase that for sure. Got a sniper. Maybe keep our infinite fire weapon in case we run out of bullets on something. Money, question mark, gun. Let's go question mark. Question mark. I'm I'm guessing it really just means that uh, it'll be one of the other options. What I'd like to see is some unique thing. Some event. That's a cookie. Cookie box. I got one cookie, y'all. More cookie? Let's go money. Does it have aim assist? Yeah, that does seem like there's a little aim assist. I, I did see that in the menu, too. That's a big raccoon. Walking over the traps, though. It's nice that you can use that to your advantage. Saving ammo. The second one? Idiot. Can I quickly dash over those things? Yes, I can. But it up, but it up, but it up. This is a new character, maybe? Right? 42, meaning of life, universe, and everything. Thank you, Echo Rain. Welcome back. Are you playing on controller? Yes. Look a little bit of a ripoff of Game of Thrones. It is known. Catch. First egg. Lavender. Could just be like a color thing, too. Or maybe there are AK Zolotls that have different stats. 
Rainbow. There are plenty of axolittles littles to be found in the wild. Sometimes they end up here, but some of our some are still hiding out there. Those little buggers. All right. Go for money. We're just doing so well with the weapons. A bullet hit me. Didn't think it was going to. Out of ammo. Should have seen that coming. Doing so well with this gun. Hey, I got a sword. Looks like it eats bullets. That's good. I, I hate a game like this where you just like physically can't use the melee weapons. Because it's all gun and bullet based. Wow, 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 uh, uh, possible shop, maybe? I don't know. It looks like a bag with the, the money symbol on it. Carbine. Lemon juice. Can I look at what it does before I purchase it? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Why are you barking at me? Axopedia. No. Are those all the axolotls that we can unlock? Holy crap. That's like flipping uh, brotato levels of characters. How do I check my stuff? I don't know how to check my stuff. I'll probably with the mouse. No. There has to be a way. There has to be a way to check my gear. There's no way that there's not a spot to check the gear. Could be a, one of these other buttons. I just don't want to waste my stuff. Hmm. No, I don't think so. Lemon, is that a shield? We did get a shield. I, I don't know. Seems like a, a shame that I, I can't look at my upgrades and it doesn't tell me what that is. That's one of those moments where you have to stand back and be like, did the people that made this game actually play any other roguelike? It's a pretty basic ask. Kids like Dara Ditos so much, I've had to start mining for them. Oh, these are like their Dorito monies. Dora Ditos. It's possible I don't know how to activate it. It could totally be my fault. I don't know. They only played Isaac. The hitbox on the bullets are a lot bigger than you think. Uh, another sword, okay. Reload my sword, put more sword in it. Boss fight. How do I feel like these dragonflies are gonna, like, actually do something? I don't know. That's got that new sword smell. Pond Pincher! Don't- I didn't get to read that. Bottom part of it, at least. Seems immune when it's spinning. Oh my god. I'm trying to use my my active ability to heal and it's not letting me. There we go. Looks like it's Gungeon style. Get it back after doing so much damage. Of course he's dropping weapons. Oh. 
Looks like you can actually only have one weapon. Yeah. Is this gonna end or am I just gonna have to shoot him? Kinda seems like it doesn't end until you maybe break through his shield. Let's pull out a knife? Should have dodged it, lol. Sword? Seems like it's kind of easy mode here. You just cancel everything with the sword. What is that face? What was that cutscene? That was the little girl in front of the fire in the background meme. More sawed off. All right, is that it? Can I get some health? Can I eat the crab? It's food, right? All right. Classic memes. That was weird that it just like Flash that and then went away. No prompt. Fishing mini game. I'm chimp. Chips, not chimps. Chips with a Z and an S. I spend the day fishing to feed my dear pet. It's hard work, but it's honest work. I can't say no to that cutesy face. Gosh, you gotta love a funny developer. A little cringe. Just a little cringe. To just be like, here's a bunch of jokes that I know, and then just like present them with with little context. It's not it's not my least favorite. It's not my least favorite. Okay. Is it cringe? Maybe. Anyways, can I steal your bucket? Oh, I totally stole the bucket. Break the bucket for the first time. I'm so sorry. You have anything to say about that? No. You don't? Just totally cool with it. All right. I that was gonna explode. Probably should have switched from the uh, sword at this point in time. Looks like potentially, if you look in the right, we only got. Uh, leaves in that first area. Maybe that's the first biome drop and then so forth and so forth because that was the second one in the second area which makes sense Kind of feel like we're just getting the same old weapons here I'm here for you to impress me. Give me another weapon that I don't have something that's not green It does seem like they give you plenty of ammo, though, so, like... Let her rip. It's a great spot for that. Fake watch, fake watch. Guess it doesn't go away. Why would they put the chest there? It's not very nice. Health up does actually sound okay. Bow buns? Might unlock more weapons the more you play, right? It goes back to my feeling of... Oh, I pressed left trigger and not left bumper to dodge. Back to my feeling of this, this idea that's like... Your original starting point, your start of the game, should be interesting enough. You shouldn't make it so that there's, like, barely any content, right? It, it sounds like they developed the game, and then they took away content to make it a roguelike, or a roguelite. Kinda, I felt that way about, um... What was that game? Yeah, there we go. 
Shoot, uh, what was the game? The one where you're a knight and you can come back and you have like those different modifiers where you like sometimes you're giant and sometimes you're like flipped upside down, sometimes it's black and white. Gets better 50 hours in, trust me, bro. Rogue Legacy, thank you. Rogue Legacy 2, where they had like certain abilities that you just kind of like usually start with in a roguelike, but they made you unlock them, right? They designed a cool game and then they took away things that make roguelikes fun so that you could unlock them. Uh, you know, I don't know. S something to be said about, like, give me a good product and then make it better. Please. But thank you, chat. Uh, I, I lose specific words. Names. Numbers. So, it's really nice and you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. Gotta saw it off again. Oh, sniper. I did like the sniper. Only having one weapon slot, I think, is uh, pretty punishing. And maybe it's a class-based thing. It's the Binding of Isaac. Do axolotls eat meat? Are they legitimately uh, carnivores? This is correct. I'm a streamer, not a rememberer. I don't get paid to do that. Remember things? The cutest little carnivores. What do they typically eat? Like small fish or something? In the wild. I got another one. Wild. Wild color scheme. Character. I love this place. Even with all the ruckus outside, it's always peaceful in here. That's wild, man. Fish and bugs. Oh, hell yeah. They eat bugs? We need more things that eat bugs. Uh, I, we're seeing the same, like, four weapons. I, I have no motivation to go for a weapon thing. Um, it's, you know, it's, it's possible we get something new that we haven't seen, but... The game's not making me feel that way. So maybe we'll... Rack up on the money and try to buy some more passives. The fact that we, uh... We've gone so far, and we only have two passive items is, is interesting as well. I'd love to get more passives. Please. Colorful? Yeah, I think they did a pretty good job with the pixel art. Soundtrack, once again. It's great. Hey, there's my butter knife. We saw that before. Do I remember what it does? I think it was 10% damage. Bark, bark, bark. Ten bullets left on my sniper rifle. Don't mind if I break everything that you own, do you? Besides the cart. Offer various wares and products in exchange for Dora Ditos. Hi, Mr. Hots. Coder Dev, what's up? Co Codered. Codered? Ignore me. Code Red Dev. Codered. Alright, we're out of sniper. Duh. Coded. Code red. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, I did get hit there. 
technically. I don't want Geico insurance. Get back. Does, oh, does barrel break do anything? Um, some of the barrels seem to be like poisonous, possibly explosive. All right, we need a new weapon stat. That'll do. Right before the boss, perfect. Hello, hello kitty. Emphasis on hell. Got tagged there, I took some damage. matches up with those lasers. Oh. Out of our weapon. Too far. Made my food yet? No, still not. There we go. Okay, that's that's tough. Got him. Too bad I don't get an insta charge on my heal. Or an insta heal on my charge. We did it. Hello kitty, I get it now. Let's see here. Let's do it. Wow, one punch. Does the fish help? Thanks to the fish, sucker. I want to do the fishing. Can I fish? Give me a turn. Mom said it's my turn. Fire. Heal on the fire. There is a heal. Only one. I forgot. Moving on. One Punch Man reference. Those bees. I think auto collection of the Doritos after the uh, room is done is always nice, but. All right, beeswax, honeycomb, gonna be the uh, thing of this area. Let's go for a heal. Gonna go back to work. See you, chat. See you, Sage. Enemies are just walking right over the traps. Works for me. It's a lot of honeycomb.
A star. Oh my goodness. Are you telling me? Are you telling me that that is a passive item? Also, I took the one that I thought was going to give me food and end up giving me uh, resources. My bad. Not very good accuracy on this guy. Don't matter. We get that honeycomb. You get craftables. Increase max ammo by 10%. So spicy, you generate a trail of fire. Hurts, but increases your health by one, and you obtain one shield. Zombie meat, Minecraft. Um, I'm thinking between chili and zombie meat. Let's go chili here. It's blue. Maybe that means rarer. Let's not forget to grab it. Uh, Axolotl buddy question mark or Doritos. Let's go Axolotl buddy. Get those unlocks. Bubblegum. Marshmallow. Adorable. Okay, same voice line. Can I break this? No. Can I break these? Axolotls, axolittles. Those are the axolittles. Yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. The Doritos don't last forever, so. Got stuck in the corner. I got shot there. Very extreme camera pointing. Like if I'm looking down, it's showing like like I'm almost off the screen. My character is. I'm just afraid I'm gonna back up into something. Right? Like, if something was up here, I wouldn't know about it until I already walked into it. Trail of Fire, honestly, for a lot of enemies that are projectile-based, it doesn't seem like it's going to be that useful. But we'll see. Maybe there's going to be a boss or an enemy that's going to chase me down, and I'll be happy to have it. Die. Bee's nest. Beehive. Oh, can't get that one. Can't get that one. Question mark. Weapon or Doritos? Question mark. Breakable stuff that have a glitter effect give items. Those who don't, don't. I'm dying. In the girls' bathroom. Can I in? Owls, late though. Come around this corner, suckers. You think you're sly? Dude thinks he's sly freaking Cooper. I don't want your honeycomb, I want your health. A 24 honeycomb though, way more than any other thing that we picked up. It's too bad I don't have a grenade. A grenade would be heavenly right here. Uh, 
Mother of the Fox say, yep, 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 yo. That's probably why it's yep, yep, and... And then he goes, nee, nee, nee. Nee, 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 It's just memorific. Hang me daddy, 24 months, that's two full years. Welcome back to you. Shop me. Isaac or Gungeon, which do you prefer? Isaac. Gungeon's solid, but... Gungeon could be what Isaac was if they didn't make it uh, with spaghetti code, if they actually made it so they could continually update the game as much as Isaac has been updated. Gungeon, I, would, I still play Gungeon, even though they don't, but I would, I would play it even more. I would play it even more if they updated the shit out of it and opened it up and made it easy to mod. That's where Gungeon dropped the ball. Literally goes din 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 and ka ka ka. I don't know if the devs know their roguelikes, but do they know they do their, know their memes? What do we got? Uh, ten percent increase in ammo. We got a shot gun of fire and a katana. I'm gonna go ahead and take the magazine, which leaves us with enough to get this other passive item. I suppose I'll take that too, since I feel like we're short on passives. Not really digging this game. It feels charmless, like Gungeon, but with no idea for itself. At least that's what I feel based off what I've seen, and yeah, it feels slow. There is some element in there that does feel missing. I agree with you. And honestly, it could just be something as slightly... Babe, that's Axel months. Minor. Thank you, Nola Bell, for 80 months. That's huge. That's huge. Welcome back to you. Appreciate you. Minor adds like just a little bit of onto the pixel art and maybe like a little bit fine tuning onto the sound effects. That could really go a long ways. Trailer was fire. I feel like a lot of the enemy design has been pretty same Sam so far. I full well understand this is the first run. I full well understand this is the first run. The environment design is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I, I like it. There's a lot going on. There's a lot to see. Looks very pretty. Uh, boss time though. I, I wish that it was... Like, maybe I, I, I don't know. Some, something about it, like, feels like it's not super fluid. I think I, I just feel like I'm moving slowly. Socket snake. Nice Dan Maku.
onto my starting weapon. Maybe be covering more ground here so that it can run over my fire. Interesting attack. Is getting faster. Gosh, is it painful to run out of ammo? Seems like once you find a spot that that works, you can just kind of forget about it. Got him. The sawed off. We do have the shot gun of fire. Love the design of the snake. It's really derpy and funny his eyes and face. Give me them fish. Give me your fish. You're here, you're girl. Don't even need the heal. It's got a sign that says left and right. There's only one way to go. That was a Kuma. Stop that. The gator ate my face. I am not snack. Sniper. I think that some of these things in here are gonna give me something. Where are we gonna get environmental, the, the resource drops? Should sparkle. Enemies are taking so many bullets, I'm, I'm running out of ammo so quickly now. Sniper is real good. Might be spoiled because of Voidigo's charm. The fact that a game like Voidigo can come out after there's been so many oh, roguelikes says to me, though, that games still have the opportunity to come out with charm. What, how am I holding my sniper rifle? This look weird, is it just me? Fire seems to be doing a number to those turtles. Data now, mushroom. Dick rifle. Got here really late, lol. Golden, what's up? Holding it like a badass. Kind of like holding it up and then like pew, pew. <laughs> Flick of the wrist. Big fire. I did extinguish the fire. Um, potentially try this for food. Not a very accurate sniper. Starting with only, was it 38 bullets? And then missing a bunch of them? That that hurts. One left. I got a mini boss here too. Great. 
love being out of ammo. Did I get something? I think it might have been the shotgun of fire that decreases my accuracy. That that, that was a thing, right? 40% damage up, but accuracy decreased. I thought it was damage up on shotguns, but that was what I, yeah, not actually what it was. Hey, what did you come over here? Yeah, I'll wait. Over here, though? I just, I don't want to have to walk through that, uh... Bullet swarm. You're far enough away from him that he comes to me. Come over here. There we go. Corner is good. JGR, 34 months. Welcome back to you. on the opposite side now. I'm, I'm dying. That was super unlucky spawn of that, that enemy. Need weapon, please. It was not food, once again, even though it was a fork and a knife. It was the resources, so we're still low on the food. Health up. There it is. Oopsie. Regenerate A. Hello, pawn. Die for the first time. Okay. Nugget. As a new axe, a little egg. Be sure to take good care of it. As a chicken, I feel the responsibility to stay around. You don't mind, right? Axe of little babies require nurturing for happiness and growth. Tend to them, enhancing their happiness levels. Only when the axe of littles are fully happy, they'll be able to grow up. Be cautious. Neglect may lead to a decline in their happiness. Before long, you'll have an adorable little squad at your disposal. A happy axe of little is a deadly axe of little. So it's like a... Well, I don't know what you would want to call this. Pick up. Like Sonic Chow Garden? Nurture. What is this? Grab his face. What am I doing? Spray bottle? Oh, you're dirty. What am, what am I? How do I... Diaper. Diaper change. Chat, what am I doing? <laughs> what the hell am I doing? Hatch. Nurture. Alright. I feel like there could be something really fun about this. Almost WarioWare style. 
This doesn't feel it, though. Um... A. It's A, okay. Press B, you back out. Okay. Pick you up. Yeah, I don't know, like, maybe I would bring you somewhere? I don't know why I would bring you somewhere. So there's a bunch of different gardens for different axolittles. Kids clip game for caring for babies. Giving attention makes them happy. Don't ignore them for too long. These poor babies may get sad. And sad babies can't grow. Wouldn't that be nice if that's how, like, how real life works? That like adults would only turn into adults if they were capable human beings. Alright, well... Next run, I suppose. You have the option to just not deal with the axe a little. It kind of seems like it's a core part of the game. Phaser. I don't know what that is. Take it. What's this, though? Scatterer? Shoddy. Um, I'll try the phaser. Let's do it. Oh, I was gonna change the buttons around, and I, I totally forgot. I, we could just go like this and ab abandon. Who cares? Is there a way to change the buttons? Doesn't seem to be still. Main menu. Right here. Controls. So we want dash as left trigger. First center or zero all sticks and axes and press any button or wait for the timer to finish. Left trigger is already in use. Do you want to replace it? Yes. And then ability left bumper. Shoulder, whatever you want to call it. I don't know what left trigger minus is, but let's just try it again. That's how you get upgrades. That's so lame. That's how you get new characters? Yeah, I don't know. Vez... Vesbaris Prime. Vesbaris Prime? Four months, I like this game. Alright. Let's get back in. Hopefully it's fixed now. Wow, wow. My left trigger is not, not dashing. It said left trigger, but it also said left trigger minus. What does that mean? It, it was being weird, but I was trying to, to make that my thing. Um, okay, we broke it. I, I don't know why. You have to take the trigger out of its socket to activate it. Wait, what? The left trigger. Replace. First center or zero all sticks and axes. Press the button. Or wait for the timer to finish. Or press a button or move an axis to assign it to dash. There. Yeah, I don't know what that was about. I must have, like, hit up or down or something, and then gave it a directional thing. I have no idea. That should work. Yep. We're back on. Back to it. Control changes are weird AF. I've never seen anything like that. It's never been that difficult. So, we didn't actually unlock any new weapons, right? We only have the new starter weapon. Kind of feel like... I'd like to see more weapons in the game itself. Very weak. As a starter weapon usually is. Uh, star was a passive item, right? What I do is delete the controls and do it from ground up.
P adapter increases your fire rate by 60%, but decreases your damage by 30. Um, that seems like a decent trade-off, right? Obtain immunity to spike traps. I, I guess fire rate by 60%, damage by 30. It just means that like you're gonna have a lot less bullets, right? You're gonna rip through your bullets so much faster. It's gonna take more bullets to kill the enemy. You're not gonna get more bullets, I'm assuming. Heavy duty boots, obtain immunity to spike traps, or your insurance paid off, heals three health. Reroll. I kind of want to see what, what it's going to do. Is it as bad as it looks like? Because it's gold, right? It seems like it's actually really good. So, still have 150 bullets on this. It'll be good for my main, my, my starter weapon, which has infinite ammo. I suppose. Green dude is so good. Oh, I, I pressed right or left bumper this time. <laughs> I don't have it in my head that I fixed the, the trigger. Should have should have started that way. Should have should have done it immediately. So I didn't get used to it. What is the diamond? intense here to have two mini boss guys In a small small room Way more damage on the non-starter weapons. But yeah, we're, we're ripping through our bullets so much, I'm not sure I would take that again. Normal bag may contain things. Shot gunfire or chili. Sounds pretty lame. Can I go down to reload? Re-reroll, I mean. Normal bag, black goo. Only one of them re-rolled. I guess we'll try the bag. This just gave me Doritos. Unfortunate. Better with a different starter weapon. That one seems to be low damage, but pierce. Anyone see what that achievement was I just got? Can't jump over the... Oh... Heal off. What is this? Pistola? Laser is infinite range. That is positive. I will definitely take the magazine upgrade. Tap shoot. If I hold it down, it doesn't fire. So this seems very negative with that upgrade. If it's already tap shoot. Not the best weapon for this. 
Basically just de decreasing the damage, increasing bullet usage. Pond Pincher. Don't pinch the mustache. Would have been nice to get a new weapon. I guess halfway through it drops weapons. I got so many itches on my face right now. Pew, 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 pew. This will be a while. Sniper? Soy milk sniper. Better pop his bubble. I walked into the thing and I took damage. Also tap shoot. Speed which we got. He's got a butt. Stop with the noise and careful, don't break the bucket. What? Good room, good room. Good hostile, everybody. Let's keep the gun I got, I think. The diamond seems like it's just an upgrade, but a, a, a rarer one. Tried to dodge the wrong button again. New mini boss. fire rate. What does that look like? They just can't even shoot at you. Another katana. Normal bag. Charger. Activate ability charge 15% faster. Uh, I'm assuming that maybe different axolotls have different active abilities. This one will give me more heal. Crunch. Catch you on YouTube. Gotta go. See you, Paige. I'm gonna go for the health up. Call me old. Me? Yeah, 
at him with those snips. Take that when we leave. It uses up a charge on your katana. Even if you miss. Which is a little stinky. Damage 10%, sticky goo, empty can. Increases your speed by 0.5 with gamer juice. I guess butter knife. Doritos? I don't know. It's a bummer because you can tell the devs really love roguelikes, but they just don't know how to design their own. I don't think this is a, a bad experience so far. I just don't think that it stands out from the crowd, for me, personally. It seems like it's a perfect game for somebody out there that's looking for the next thing to pass time with. And they just really love roguelikes. And they want to collect and beat them all. Totally saw a game for that. For me, who's looking for something that I want to continue playing for, you know, 100, 200, 300 hours. Which is, I, you know, I, I really don't think that one uh, should not expect that from a roguelike. It's kind of the idea of a game that you can infinitely play as many times as you'd like. Um, it's, yeah, I don't know if it's going to be the next best thing. But, once again, there are a lot of people out there that are looking for the next game to play. And especially a game that doesn't cost $60. Totally viable. It's a totally viable option. A lot of people out there, too, they're like... You know, I've got 20 bucks this week, and I want to buy something and only play that game. Whereas I, you know, I obviously get like 100 game codes every single day. I, I don't have to sit there and play a game that I'm not like super crazy about. How many hours is Rebirth at for you on stream? On Steam at this point in time. Rebirth is... 4,600. What is this? Heavy duty boots. I don't remember what that was. Uh, speed up by... something? I, I don't remember. No, the speed up was the can. Heavy duty boots, I think, was immunity to spikes. Like immunity? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doritos or the gun? Oh, okay, it did, did hurt me there. Got hit there again, and again. Katana throws you forward. Got me in trouble there. Pushed me into that enemy. And then now boss at two health. Great. Could have kept the katana, I guess. Why does my mouse pointer keep coming on the screen? Hell, low kitty. Oh, this is just a. I thought this was the uh, sawed off shotgun. It's the pistol. One of my least favorite options.
Oh, almost got in trouble on that one. Got down to a science now. Looks like bosses are all the same per run. I could be wrong about that though. The first boss has the ability to uh, drop weapons. This boss does not seem to do that. I, I wasn't looking at how loud that was. Just, I mean, specifically this boss. I turned it down. This boss is just too much. Too much volume. Got him. Remind me again on the store page. Not this one. Uh, this one. This is going for $18.99. AK is a lot of going for $18.99. I have to be honest, I was thinking that this thing was going to be going for maybe $9 on the store. Double that seems like a lot. Again, once again, if you're gonna give me soy milk but have it be ammo based, I feel like it should be like what was it? 60% plus fire rate, 30% down on damage, plus 30, 40%, 50%, some sort of number in there for plus ammo, plus max ammo. Of course, you could just make it so that you know. Lacking more ammo is part of the difficulty, but is it on switch? Is this on switch? Uh, I, I don't know that anyone know in chat This is why games should not should this is why games do do sponsorships, right? Because then they actually like can brief me on all the information so I know the hell I'm talking about when I'm playing the game Providing like links and stuff. I can't speak to the entirety of the game. Once again, not an official review here. Um, but it, it does feel like that's that's too much money. There could totally be some sort of end game I don't know about. End game content. Steak break. Like that, yeah, that's gonna say that frog should be dead. Pushing the other guy. Pushing him around. Don't forget the parent simulator in the overworld. 
It's a great idea. It's a great idea. I really love the Chow Garden. Um, I, I don't feel like I fully understand. You know, you just have to walk up there and once again do some sort of kind of like random WarioWare style minigame to care for your children. There's got to be something to use these resources on. I bet you we're going to find what that is after this run. Maybe there are things you can craft for your kids. Maybe it's crafting upgrades, unlocks. We haven't seen that, right? We haven't seen like a legitimate skill tree for unlockables, like new weapons and stuff. Taco McMacho. Thanks for the prime sub. I appreciate you. Zaps enemies when they get too close. Let's... It, uh, maybe damage up by 40% though, because we got damage down by 30. We could pump it right back up by 40. It would just decrease my accuracy. The accuracy down was kind of painful. Not going to lie. Let's go battery. Let's try it out. One of these days, I'm going to not pick up the dang item. I, I really want a weapon here. I really want more health. You know, I was going to say, let's go for the passive, but I don't, I don't know. I've not been, like, super crazy about the passives. I feel like maybe more health is the answer. Why does my mouse pointer keep showing up? Yep, 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 yo. What does the fox shoot? Oh, got me. But I shocked him. But like there's like five weapons or something in the game. There's got to be more, right? There has to be some sort of skill tree unlock system that we haven't seen yet. And and I think that that like is a totally viable thing, right? Is to step somebody through those systems very very slowly. I just feel like maybe that could have came before the axolittles, personally. Gives you a little bit more purpose when you're playing a roguelite. Direction, I think, is nice. Um, I guess I'll go question mark. Katana's OP. I do I do like Katana. It's one of my favorites, for sure. I think the shotgun's also really, really good. It's tough on an enemy like this, though. Is that a turret? There's turrets on the wall. First I saw those. Victor, 11 months, welcome back. What does the raccoon say? Oh. Infinite range, nice. Damage though, the damage on some of these weapons, it's just like actually soul crushing. Need gun. is shockingly bad. Would really love to see more items that change up the way that you play the game. 
too. I I, I think that a, a game like this, any any roguelike roguelite, really uh, doesn't doesn't do the genre justice when uh, it's got only web or only items rather that are like gives you a 10% damage boost. You know, obviously the shock adds a little something in there, but I'm not very impressed with it. Maybe there's some like really, really cool melee roll build that you could do. I don't know. But of course the idea of a build and synergies and stuff. It's also a fun mechanic. I loved, loved, loved when Gungeon added their synergy system. There's my katana. <clears throat> I wish Gungeon received more love. I mean, people are just picking up Gungeon now and they're going through it all. Like, I see so many YouTubers going through all of the unlocks and stuff. Can I heal? Not ready yet. The dude just ran into me. I, how am I gonna? <laughs> I guess I gotta laser him. Shoot. I'm on my third save file, and Isaac having as much fun as the first save file, but Gungeon was special. Got free on Epic Game Store before. Gungeon's still pretty cheap. In comparison to this. How much is Gungeon? On Steam. If you were to buy it right now. Dramatic. Dramatic. One more billion dollars. I didn't like Gungeon, to be honest. Maybe. If is 15. Well, you guys can't start talking shit about it if we don't know for sure. Enter the Gungeon. Is $15. Maybe you were saying it is. You said if is. But you're posing a question. We're so close. The end of this level. Orange juice, don't know what you do. Pepper, that's a trail of fire. Yeah, not being able to see what your items do right now is kind of unacceptable. Still feel like there's got to be a way to do it, I just don't know how. What they're going to charge this game's DLC. Maybe at, uh, you know, $20, $19, it'll be free DLC. But to play a game for the first time ever and feel like it needs DLC, that's, that's not a happy, happy feeling to have. The divers, twenty bucks. I mean, at twenty dollars, I expect to see some like I don't know, sexy axolotl boobies or something. You know. Hey, okay, my abilities ready. Rogue lights don't normally go for twenty dollars. Any bullets, ten dollars. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe they uh, decided to capitalize on the the cuteness of it and the 
you know, the hype just strictly around the art direction and the axolotl. I feel like everyone just grabbed onto it because they're like, I love axolotls. That's my shit. And they're like, ah, hell, maybe we could do 20, 20 bucks. Like, people would go for it. Wink at me. You sicko. Get some shock damage off. That was a nice amount of damage. Tail? love to see, too, in a game like this, when you get, uh... Oh, I actually touched him there. I love it. Ow. When you get a bonus for doing it perfectly, the boss. I think that's a good mechanic. A game that rewards you for playing well. A shadow? Okay, interesting. <laughs> do 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 the good old day of filling the bucket. so enemies don't spawn behind me again. This is the sawed off, I think. Shot me right in the booty. Can I fall into that water? No. Need to stake break. You gotta wait for that thing to sparkle up there. Only then can you actually eat your steak. Have your steak and eat it too. Mushrooms! We'll go with the passive upgrade. I still don't know what cookies are. Was I using cookies to hatch my axe a little, maybe? Because I do have zero cookies now. And I thought I got cookies. My next update for Binding of Isaac. Yeah, I don't know. Probably end of the year, I guess. Anyone remember? There's the whole co-op mode mod. <laughs> the noises. I didn't get the stuff. I didn't get the Doritos before they disappeared.
hate this guy. Least favorite guy. The minigun dude. Trying to laser him here. Shock him. There we go. Like how you can just see me through walls too. It's always a mechanic that bothers me a little bit in games. Especially a game like this where you gotta use cover. There's like, I know exactly where you are. It's like, yeah, sure, 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 sure. Obviously I can see everybody on the battlefield, so maybe that's an unfair advantage. And they should just be able to see me too. I don't know. Starting gun's really bad. Yeah, it really is. The last one was too though. I just thought that, like, the shotgun probably is really powerful, but it was such short range. Sometimes you just gotta have range. Oh, man, there's a weapon there. Can I have it? Rip to that guy. Let's leave with the katana. Use up the rest of this one now, though. God, this guy sucks. It's like rarely ever takes breaks. What you got? Normal bag, black goo, shotgun if I hear. Sticky goo, I guess. There's gotta be more items. Even if there is an unlock system where you can unlock new things to see, <laughs> that is still a shocking, shockingly low amount of I items. The stream going butts. To start off with, Epic Whip Nene, thank you for the sexy tier two sub, 12 months, that's a full year. It's going, it's going. We're doing our thing. For $20, I think there should be like a hundred starting items. This guy just jumped into me. Into me, onto me. Oh my freaking frick. We're in trouble here. Too many, too many hoppers. Katana's not cutting it here. Get it? Cutting it? Oh, he got me there at the end. That was super rough. Melee enemies. You think a katana would be good for anything that approaches me, but... No, it's, it's really the best for... ...canceling bullets. Pistol. Did I get that help? Yeah, I did. Katana killing bullets is neat. This looks like a game I can get behind. I love axolotls. That's what I'm talking about. That's the target market, chat. That's why it's $20. You blindly follow the axolotls. Baited. I am the target market. So that's funny, that's funny. I, I don't think that anyone's wrong if they're loving this game. Once again, I'll go back to what I said earlier when I said that, like, totally cool for people that are like, I need the next roguelike itch, and this is it. Like, go, go do it, get it. But we were also talking about the fact that it's twenty dollars. Oh, okay, how? Twenty dollars seems surprising. And that people are are blindly following the axolotl. I was targeted in a market once. Was it a rubber market?
This doesn't scratch any itch other than bad, though. I, I don't think it's it's bad. It's just it, everything is is relative, right? Once again, if this was like eight dollars, five dollars on the store, I'd be like, yeah, hell yeah, like pick it up and have some fun. If it was co-op, right? There was some sort of co-op to it, which let's, let's double check. Single player. If there was co-op to this, it didn't say like Steam remote play or anything. Remote play on phone, tablet, TV. Remote play together. It says remote play together. But it doesn't say it's multiplayer. Don't you have to have mul... How do you have remote play together if you don't have multiplayer? Am I too stupid to understand this? Local? This is... Oh, we're looking to enter the gungeon still. Thank you. Which does have co-op and or, or multiplayer, right? And why doesn't it say that? Anyways, Axolotl. AK is a lotl. Single player. Just single player. Okay. So here's what I would say. I would say the game feels like it's about $5. And then I would say that if it was co-op, if there was some sort of multiplayer to it, I would bump that up to $10. My personal opinion so far does mean controller dual play. Um, we just need a weapon, I think. Could could have co-op in the future, absolutely. But sadly, I think at uh, eighteen dollars, and with this start might not get off the ground you're holding the, the gun backwards sir sir you're gonna shoot yourself Could be holding the gun backwards because its first attack is a charge. Headbutt. Butt of the rifle? I don't know. Let's assume it's intentional. That's certainly difficult enough. And uh, to its credit, all damage taken, most, I would say most of the damage taken so far seems like it was deserved. That I made a, a legitimate mistake. Or RNG got me, cornered me. Hit me with something I couldn't handle. Doesn't seem like it was buggy or some, you know, weird things happening. Would say though that Bayou vibes with the noose. It's slightly questionable. Guess it's not really a Bayou. It looks very alien. Let's go. Probably shop. This looks harder than Gungeon. Um, I would say that Gungeon was one of the toughest gaming experiences. I've had. Um, I'll take the med kit here. For health. Absolutely. Definitely needed that. Uh, I would say that this does not feel as tough as Gungeon. How many runs did it take for me to get to the, the final boss on Gungeon? Right? Like, a lot. We were, we were dying on the first floor in Gungeon. Doritos are gun. Buy the katana for more charges. Um, I don't know if they stack. If you can go past max. Because there's like a weapon upgrade that gives you more max. Oh, it's just it's too much. 
going on with these jumpy jumps. I'm gonna take more damage. Sawed off for the boss. I don't know how much range I'm gonna need. We'll go with this guy, I guess. I'm so angry right now! You had to come and disturb our peace, right? It's the fisherman. It's chips! My bucket is broken and now we will break you. Go fish. Attack. Fish and chips, so long, and thanks for all the fish and chips. Oh, okay. I'm trying to heal here. Goes all of our DPS. I took damage there twice. I don't know. Okay, that, that seemed weird. I don't know about that. Didn't know about that attack. That's not my fault, buddy. I hear you. You're you're yelling at me right now, and uh, you're gonna stand in front of the screen. It's gonna be great. Thanks. Thanks for playing. That slaps. Ham came back. Got me. Oopsie. Alright, you guys. This has been our first look at AK Zalotl. Looks like we have more buddies, even though I didn't find any more buddies, question mark? I didn't see any spots to find buddies. The attention makes them happy. Don't ignore them for too long. These poor babies, they may get sad. Sad babies can't grow. You already told me that. Dude, I do see you. I do see you there. No chewing on my mic cables, though. Nurture. Eat this. Here comes the plane. I'm watching you. You just ate half the spoon. Keep an eye on this ham. He loses table privileges if he bites my mic cable. There's a cat tooth mark in it right now. He deserves a mic cable treat. He deserves butt scritches, but that's it. Diaper change. I, I, I just have to say, I think that you can do a little bit better on the minigame than to like slowly drag a uh, diaper across the screen to then put it on. Like, I don't have, I'm not even clicking the screen for that. Feels a little sad. This one, at least you have to press a button. Need to capitalize on that cat. Who else have I not nurtured? Wait, that's the exact same one. Did I nurture all these guys? No, no, I did not. Thought I saw grow on one of them. Are you yawning at me again? What's a roguelike that we can make based on ham? Ham cat? Ham cat. And the butt pad of doom? 
All right, who's this new character down here? I'm watching you. No biting that. You can't bite that. But it looks so delicious, buddy. Bliss Taker is hungry. Bring the little happy ones to me, yes? Crystal takes happiness from the babies, and I give you permanent upgrades, yes? Please. Wait. What? I bring you a happy baby, and you harvest their happiness? Oh, Grow. I, I do see that. Okay, Grow is on one of them. That was right. Okay, now we have a cauldron. Now what? Pet. Okay. Top one, two. Let's say that I want to take its happiness and harvest it instead of growing it. Put it in the cauldron. Destroy it. You want this? Talk by. Crystal takes happiness and you get rewards, yes. Oh, 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 maybe the crystal over there on the other side. Bye. The Bliss Taker is a shady creature that trades permanent upgrades in exchange for happiness. Position your axolotl babies near the magical crystal and extract their happiness in exchange for your harvest for some enticing upgrades. Exchanging smiles for power qualifies as morally gray, right? Okay, so I don't have any hearts, so I can't I can't buy anything from him. What what could I buy though again? Primary weapon damage. Reload time. The healing black tea room can appear in biome one. Increase weapon drop rarity. Increase pickup area. In increases extra Doradito drop chance. Adds one reroll to the shop room. Okay, can I I pick up my buddy again. It doesn't look like I can pick up my buddy again. I put him here and he's just... He's locked behind the uh, Bliss Taker guy. Alright, you can have him then. What else? That baby's his now. You got something to say? You know how teenagers get, all they care about is food. Try cooking something for them to help them grow into strong adults, huh? Don't look at me like that. Collect ingredients and bring them to the cooking pot to prepare recipes for your teen and adult axolittles. Main courses will help them grow into unique class, while serving them dessert will provide them with new active abilities. Unleash your inner chef by mixing and matching classes with abilities. That seems cool. You get to make your own classes. Salt baked bass. Rice with things. Sweet grilled shroom. Who wants to eat it? Teenager. Babies don't eat confirmed. Here you go. That's it? You're an adult now? Swap! Yep, okay. Now I'm this person. Um, was I supposed to read any information there about, like, what you you actually had? Here we go. Maniac lets you carry two secondary weapons. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. But I don't have a different... I don't have an active thing. Like, this guy's got snack and do the healing. I don't know if we would have survived if it wasn't for the healing. If I'm being honest. Let's try harvesting some happiness right now. But absorb. Absorb the happiness of an axe a little for the first time. Poor guy. Cook him a dessert to get him an active sounded like. What do you have to say now? Adult axolotls are ready for battle. Swap places with one of them and unleash them into the wilderness. Each one is different, so keep an eye out for the new combos. Once your axolotl reach adulthood, you'll have the option to alter their unique weapons and styles. Achieve this by accessing the Axopedia and giving them cookies. Okay, we did... I thought we had some cookies at one point in time, but... Weapon spec. Gunslinger, trooper, gangster... 
gangster, marksman, scout, berserker, demolitionist, and cyborg. For example, cyborg increases laser weapon damage by 10% and they become more common. Scout, shotgun weapon damage by 10%. Gangster, SMG. So pistol, assault, SMG, sniper, shotgun, melee, explosive, laser. Alright. Let's see about a dessert. How do I do that? Anchovy juice. Let's see here. Cancel ability when eaten. Press the ability button to destroy all enemy bullets. Pit candy. Lotzilla ability. Uh, to grow for a few seconds and become immune. Call for a weapon. Chest drop. Destroy everything. You have 50% chance to survive. Hold the ability button without moving to spawn a random item. Cursed ice cream. Random item? Like a passive upgrade item? Or... Or what? That, did I make it? Did I not have enough stuff? Oh, it, it's white, but I don't actually have that ingredient. So let's go with the... Pit candy. But they expect you to die sooner, so you get these upgrades earlier. Maybe you were too good, lol. Oh, how do I just eat it myself? I want I want my character right now to eat it. I don't want to feed it to this guy, no. So you're saying I gotta to switch to this guy just so that I can grab the pit candy and feed it to the other one? That's... yeah, that seems a little backwards. Seems a little backwards. I should just be able to eat it if I want to upgrade this specific character. Um, Axopedia, how do I get to that? So now what do you got? That Lotzilla. Cool, cool, cool. All right, well, like I said, this is our first time playing Axolotl. AK is a lotl, I mean. Uh, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Do you want to see more of this? And why? Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.